man. <clears throat> this shit just leaves you drained at the end of the day. I mean, bruh. Black men are doing horrible overseas, man. Why are there so many passport bros overseas dating ugly women when you have, like, white men walking around with stunners overseas? Why is that, bro? It has to be about the money, man. You see what I'm saying? Because I feel like if you a passport bro doing very well overseas, you will get a stunner. But a lot of you guys are not getting, you're not getting beautiful women, bro. I keep seeing these channels with the white boys, you know, I mean, having beautiful women. The white men got beautiful women over there, bro. <clears throat> and your passport bros got average to below average women out there. I mean, this is what I'm talking about, man. This, this is what makes me upset. Because I'm subscribed to a few channels where you got like a busted, ugly white dude with a fine ass uh, Thai woman or Filipina. You know, and then you got like a passport bro channel, female just average, right? Or she's below average, or she's a hooker, or she's a hoe, she's a prostitute. It's like, damn, no, 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 passport bros are not winning, bro. Every time I turn on this goddamn fucking goddamn YouTube, bro, and I'm looking at some of these passport uh, passport bro channels, and I'm just like really, really <clears throat> disappointed, disappointed in black men overseas right now. The way you motherfuckers are getting these women that are just not attractive at all, and I'm seeing white boys walking around with stunners, okay. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying it's depressing it's like bro do better when you go overseas get beautiful women over there I thought I thought passport bros was supposed to be getting beautiful young hot tenderonies not like these these women that a lot of these dudes don't even want to touch man a lot of the men of, of of their country wouldn't even touch that with a 10-foot pole, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's why I say, man, a lot of cats' money don't be right. That's the reason why you ain't getting these stunners, man. It's like the black man is doing horrible overseas. I mean, it's like the whole entire fucking goddamn world thinks that we deserve the worst even when it comes to like dating overseas it's like like i said man so many channels that i'm subscribed to i ain't gonna say their names or whatever but so many like white boy channels overseas that i'm subscribed to they got all the beautiful women stunners and all that stuff but then you know subscribe to like some of these passport bros um channels man and I'm seeing just a whole lot of average and below man and it's depressing it's like man dude I want to go overseas to get stunners bro <clears throat> you know but then I thought I thought about what you know, um, Sunshine Shoulders had said, he said, man, I see white boys walking around with beautiful stunners until I seen this black man out there in the Philippines with a stunner, but he had a pension. You see what I'm saying? See, it's about that money, bro. 
if you ain't got your bread right, you're going to get average and below average women. So even overseas, if your money is tight and right, you're going to get a stunner no matter what color you are. But it's just the thing is, the, the white boys got more money, man, when they go over there. I, you guys got to start turning these these bus downs and these women who are average and below. You got to start turning them down and getting better women, man. Start turning down hookers and hoes too, man. Stop dating porn stars, women who are not real women, women, women who sell their bodies for money, women who have had sex on camera for money. See what I'm saying? That's that's dirty. That's low level stuff, bro. And constantly these 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 passport bros are out there dating them, bro. They I mean they're not marrying them, but they're dating these women, bro. You got you got travel versity out there just walking around with that that skank, that that dirty porn star. And he's walking around with it like it's a trophy or something. I'm like, bro, that's nothing to be proud of, bro. What's her name? So, so a super porn or supper porn or whatever her name is, bro. And he just uploaded a video because he's back in Thailand, right? And he's proud, walking around proud to have a porn star on his on his uh, arm and stuff, and I'm like, bruh, <laughs> you kissing this female, man? She done had multiple dicks inside her mouth on camera, and I'm pretty sure you done heard about it or you seen the videos that she was in, and you still like with this female. It just it makes black men look bad, and. Like, I, I, tr I plan to travel in the future with my money right, and I'm not going to be out there dating, like, like hookers, hoes, sluts. You got to fucking avoid these women at all costs. Stop going to Patia. Patia is full of whores, bro. You know what I'm saying? Patia is full of freelancers. Uh, bar girls, you just like, you niggas think that these women are regular women when they're not. You see what I'm saying? I'm saying this like black men got to start doing better, bro. You see what I'm saying? Like, I'm pretty sure white men do the same thing, dating freelancers and hoes and stuff. But black men are doing this shit on camera, bro. And they just, and it's like, wow. And they walk around with it like it's a badge of honor, like a trophy, like you, you really do. You acting like you really doing something. And I'm like, no, that's not how you're supposed to do it. I mean, think about it, man. Travel Versity is a young cat. I mean, he don't know any better. He's a he's young. He don't know. But as you get older, you start realizing like, damn. I don't want to, like, date a whore that's been selling her body to the world. She done, she done seen so many goddamn penises. That is, it's a shame, bro. It's a goddamn shame. It's real. It's really, like, saddening and heartbreaking to, to look at black men that look like me doing horrible overseas when it comes to dating. You know, <clears throat> You got David Campbell with a female that's a four to me. Maybe she could bump herself to a five if she put on some makeup and stuff and dress up. But that's a whole lot of below average to me, man. Even though he's an old crippled dude. But still, bro, there's old white men out there dating more beautiful women than her. I'm like, damn, why are black men, these passport bros, getting the short stick when it comes to dating. It's like you, you motherfuckers got like these low ass standards because the white boys are not going to fuck with the, the average women out there, bro. They don't. I seen white boys turn their nose up at average and below average Thai women. 
and then those those, those below average and average Thai women run to black men because the white boys ain't gonna want them. When the white boys come up on Thailand, the Philippines, they getting the stunners, bro. They getting beautiful women. You see what I'm saying? Why the black men get the ugly women, the average women. I mean, bro. Travel versity, his girlfriend. Other than her being a a porn star. She has a below average face, bro. You see what I'm saying? She's not that attractive in the face. The only thing she got that's working for her is her booty, bro. Her big butt. That's about it, bro. And that to me, even to me, that's kind of fat. You see what I'm saying? <clears throat> I mean, it's big and round, but it's still there's some fat there. It's, it's not tone. You see what I'm saying? I'm hard, bro. When I go overseas, bro, I'm going to be hard on them looks. I'm not walking around with this any old thing, especially if I got a lot of money in the bank. <clears throat> I ain't going to just be walking around with just any old thing, walking around with some some female that's, you know, average or below. A, it's like, no, no, no. And I, I'll come back home if I'm not getting the best, you know, the beautiful women out there, bro. If I'm not getting what the white man is getting, bro, I, I walk away, man. I'm like, oh, no, no, thank you. Nah, man, black men got to start raising those standards up. You see what I'm saying? You can't be taking anything and everything that the cat dragged in. Got to start doing better out there because I'm seeing a whole lot of dating hookers and hoes, porn stars, women that that the men of that country do not want, man. You are taking the sloppy seconds of the country, black men, out there. I mean, bro, I haven't walked up on any Passport Bro channel that has a stunner, bro. Nah, I don't. <clears throat> I guess the whole entire world think that we don't deserve beautiful women, man. But let me tell you something. You got that money right out there, you'll get them. I just think it boils down to the money, man. That's all for now.